Hi, I'm Steve Pelfrey with Stratum Reservoir Isotec, and today I would like to take a few minutes to talk to you about the importance of sample container selection for doing natural gas analyses, and also the importance of selecting the correct analytical protocols back in the laboratory. So first, the sample containers. Um, there are various types of containers designed for different types of samples. So if you have a mud gas sample, uh, we recommend the isotope paired with our sampling manifold. If you have a gas sample that is non-pressurized, a gas bag is a fantastic container to use. If you need to analyze the amount of methane dissolved in groundwater, our isoflask is the container of choice. Um, if you have pressurized gas samples, such as from a wellhead or a separator sample, a standard steel stainless steel cylinder is a great choice. Or again, the isotope works well with that when paired with our wellhead sampling manifold. Okay, so once we've received these samples in the laboratory, it's our job to work with you to determine the proper analytical suite and analysis techniques to give you all the data you need to provide a solution to your problem. Um, at Isotec, we have multiple ways of generating gas isotope data. We have our standard precision isotope systems, and we have our unique offline prep dual limlet high precision isotope systems. And knowing the difference is critical because there are times when you need the high precision data, such as time lapse geochemistry or production allocation, where you are finding the need to create an accurate mixing curve between two different end members. So we'd be happy to discuss all of these topics and more with you during our seminar in February at Stratum Reservoir's location in Houston. So we hope to see you there, or you're welcome to join us online. Thank you.